black and white, clear as crystal. You get nothing. You lose. Good day, sir. It just got very quiet all of a sudden, but hello! Hello, I am here. Welcome in, everybody. You can actually see my face today. No more no stream camp. What? <laughs> no more no cam streams. There we go. I am back to having my face on the screen. I did switch the camera around, though, because the game is on the other monitor this time, so... I had to switch my camera around, but that's okay. That is okay. So, today we are playing a game called Horticular. At least I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, I got a demo key from the developers for this game. And how would how am I how would I describe this? Let me let me pull up the game. Hold on. Let me pull it up real quick. Do do Okay, horticular. Doo -doo. It's a relaxing garden builder where you attract adorable animals and rebuild a lush landscape in a magical diorama world. How adorable is that? So I'm excited. Um, I don't have a command for this, but we will in a second because I got to open it up on Steam anyway so I can get the link for you guys because I don't think... Okay, so it is going to have that, but I don't think it will. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Um. Let me figure out how to share this. So it does plan on coming out this year, but it doesn't say when. Okay, how do I share this link? Here we go. 
Is that right? Oh, hold on. Hold on, guys. Okay, well, that's not right. <gasps> How do I do this? How do I do this? You know what? We're just gonna go to the website. <laughs> Steam website. There we go. Hold on. Sorry, guys. I am... <laughs> we reached the follower goal! Best yep. Thank you so much, new follower. You just helped me reach my goal of 700. Yay! I, uh, how do you say that? Yggdras Soft Gaming. I'm just going to call you Soft. Soft, welcome in. Thank you for becoming my 700 follower. You are so awesome. Lily. Okay. Hello, Lily. I'm going to remember that. I need to remember that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to edit this. Hold on. Do, do, do. There we go. Lily. But thank you so much for being my 700 follower. Welcome in. I'm trying to get the link for this game that I'm playing right now. So you guys could take a look at it. So you can take a look at it. Here we go. I got it. Hello. Okay, so that's the link for the game. <laughs> that I am playing right now. It is called Horticular. It's a cute little garden... Um, garden gnome game thing <laughs> it's adorable though i do i can tell you that it is very adorable but, but welcome in thank you again uh for stopping by the stream and lily thanks again for being that 700th follower i'm so excited we reached 700 our next goal is 800 so we got 100 more to go <laughs> hi Look at those cutie votes. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, is it here? Commands. I'm trying to see if I can make a command for this. <laughs> I'm trying to see if we can make a command for this. So hold on. Where's my game? Game? That's game info. That's not what we want. Do, 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 do. Um. No. Here we go. Here we go. You can wish list it here. There we go. We're just, we're just adding it to the command <laughs> so now someone types in game there you go you can wish list it there you have the same capamon oh my goodness her name is stella we've named her stella and she has a bunch of stuff you can do with her so those are the things that stella can do <laughs> but let's jump into the game i'm very excited I'm very excited to try out this game. I did get a free Steam demo for this game. My lips are so chapped, I just noticed. But I did get a free game key for this. Sorry, I gotta hydrate. Um, this is just a demo, but it's super cute. Look how adorable this is. <laughs> yeah, so she's got all sorts of things you can do with her um i don't think exclamation point song actually works so right hydrate or dehydrate <laughs> let me get the sound going for you guys once again please let me know if the sound is too loud for you guys for the game but let's jump in all right, thank you for playing the Horticular demo. It contains a sample of the story and its content. You can play for as long as you like and will be notified when the story progression stops. With Horticular's active development, some parts are not present or finished. So I sh so should you encounter a bug or a feedback, I'd love to hear about it on Discord. I, love I look forward to having the complete version in your hands soon. Robert. Well, thank you so much for that, Robert. Oh, thank you, Lily. 
<laughs> well, I'm glad you're here. And I hope that you stay. Is that... Oh. Where is this, the music coming through? It's coming through system. Okay, well... We're gonna lower that a little bit. I thought I switched it to my game... Uh, my game part, but I guess not. Also, I added a cool, funky new feature where I can move my captions to the top or the bottom depending on where things are in the game. And then I still have my camera to move back and forth as well. But let's go, let's jump in. I'm excited to try this. I am very excited. Noise. <laughs> There's a, um, there's like a filter you can add in OBS that you can, um, have things move and then you can use it through your stream deck. So, Woo. a connection. We finally found someone. Someone horticular. That's me. I'm horticular. <laughs> I don't even know what that word means. Can you hear us? Yes, I can. Do not fear. You are currently in safe transit between worlds. I wonder what that means. We have something to ask of you, but first we need to know. My name? <laughs> what should we call you? Obviously. I am Casey. Mm -hmm. That's me. Odd, but we can work with that. Excuse me. Pleased to meet you, Casey. Pleased to meet you too, whoever you are. We are the Keepers, an ancient but near-forgotten species. Our purpose is to tend to every garden. With an arcane touch, we help life flourish and persevere. You can't even see it behind me. Oh, well. However, <laughs> why is it turning red? Some time ago, our garden steward, Nightshade, mysteriously vanished. Oh, no. I can't take care of... Uh, I can't take care of gardens myself, but afterward our, oh, we could tell you more in time, but now we have an urgent plea. I can't take care of gardens in real life, but I could take care of gardens on like video games. Please, Casey, will you become our new steward and restore our world to its former splendor? You got it. I'll do it. No definition, but is defined as relating to the art or practice of garden cultivation and management. Horticulture. Yeah. Okay. So it's closest. Yes. I'm the same. I do not have a green thumb. I kill plants. I actually told my husband not to buy me flowers for like Valentine's Day or anything because they die. <laughs> what will you call your garden? <gasps> hmm. I don't want to. That's no, I don't like that name. Is there like a you told him the same? <laughs> I knew I liked you faithful. We're like so the we're such the same person. OK, I'm going to I'm going to get a name. Let's see. Garden name generator what's your garden name we are <laughs> let's see uh this i don't like this one you can grow herbs only see if you're using them for something and you know how to take care of them then yeah that's good but for someone like me especially so, Lily, I'm actually a flight attendant outside of streaming, so I'm not really home that often. So, for someone like me, it's definitely hard for me to take care of plants. <laughs> My husband definitely would not do it either, so. Um, let's see. Ooh, tranquility is pretty. Oh, I'm not even typing. Tranquility. There we go. Sounds like it would be, yeah. Stay at home mom and I still kill plants. <laughs> That's funny. I'd prob honestly I'd probably be, be the same way. When I have kids, who knows? You will arrive in tranquility any moment. Hang on. We will get in touch once you've arrived. Oh, hang on. We'll get in touch once you've arrived. Okay. I'm hanging on to the desk. I'm hanging on. I take care of my dad, so I'm almost always home. Well, look how cute. 
I mean, it's like dead, but still, it's cute. I mean, taking care of your dad's definitely good. So, I mean, if you if you could take care of of your dad and plants, then I say that's that you're doing good. <laughs> Just popping in to say a very quick hello because I've got to get to bed, but hope you have a great stream. Thank you, Dazar. Thank you so much for popping in. I hope you have a good night. We're playing a, tuto a tutorial. We're playing a demo of this game called Harticular. And uh, it's a cute little garden gnome game. So, Hello there. These tutorials will help introduce you to the world of Horticular. You can turn them off from the settings if you already know how the game plays. Should you forget anything, you can review past tutorials again from the pause menu. Now you should have a letter coming in. Okay. That's amazing that you take care of your dad. It is. It's, it is amazing. Me and my husband currently live with my mom. Um, one, to, for us to be able to save money to get our own place. And two, because she's also going through some health issues. So it's nice to just have us here. I got a letter. Greetings, Casey. We hope you arrived smoothly. If you're reading this letter, it means you found the inbox. Check on it. Check on it now and then. For now, we will communicate via letters to conserve our energy. Around you is tranquility. It's not much to look at since Nightshade's disappearance, but we're sure you will make it blossom and someday become a legendary horticularist. <laughs> In its current state, your garden is a waste where nothing grows. To plant anything, you need to dig out the land and change its surface type. We have attached a spade and a couple of surface varieties. Try digging a few times. Kindly regard your friendly keepers. Uh, I also stream as well, but I'm taking the month of February off to plan for a cyberpunk red stream. Ooh, though right now I only have one player. What is that? What's a cyberpunk red stream? Is that like the game cyberpunk? I haven't played that game yet. Your husband's mom lives with you for the same thing. She has health issues. She can still get around, but it's nice that we're able to help when we can. Yeah, no, that's good. Like my, like I said, my mom has some health issues. They're not bad. Um, like she still works and stuff, but it's just nice being here for her if she needs us to. And like, we'll go to the store for her because she, um, she was doing uh, like not DoorDash, the Instacart or whatever, and they kept delivering it to the wrong house. So she's like, nope, I'm done. So we'll we'll go shopping for her and stuff. A TTRPG tabletop, right? Tabletop RPG system made by the devs of Cyberpunk 2007 and The Witcher. Ooh. That sounds fun. I'll definitely have to check that out. I will definitely check that out. Choose the dig tool and open the catalog by pressing the interface icon or the catalog button. Select a surface from the catalog and interact with the ground patch to change its surface. Hold the interaction button to speed up the process. No, an unfinished ground patch is unusable. Okay. So we got grass. Yeah. That sounds cool. I'll definitely have to check that out. Like I said, I've never played Cyberpunk before, but I've seen people play it, so I'm kind of curious. Okay, wait. What do I do? Okay, so shovel soil do i need to do grass you're okay ordinary soil filled with minerals nutrients and organisms perfect for growing everything from carrots to tulips your standard grassy ground that is found in abundance throughout gardens and parks alike okay Ooh. oh i could put the house over it that's cool so i want to start off with like a little patch of like soil so we'll start there first and then we'll do grass, like, over here. Okay, so we'll do that. Oh, I completed my task. <laughs> I'm making a Discord bot to help streamline the character creation feature because there's a lot of jumping around the PDF otherwise. And we'll be using Foundry to visualize it. I don't know what Foundry is, but... People who are smart enough to create their own Discord bot... I applaud you. <laughs> I tried making my own Discord bot and it has not worked for me. <laughs> At least I haven't really had the time to sit and work on it more. I was working on it on my laptop, but a virtual tabletop program. Oh, wait, is that how like people play like um, Dungeons and Dragons on the computer and stuff? Look at that. I have a little grass area and a little soil area. Okay, what's my letter say? See, digging is easy, is it not? 
Filling the ground with a new surface takes some time, making the patch temporarily unusable. However, you can speed up the process with your spade if you want. Before we move on to placing items, you will need some gold. A quick way to get gold is to find forgotten treasure in the ground. It is usually not much, but every few patches you may find some. Collect some gold by digging. I think I already did that, though, didn't I? 95,000 more points of VIP! Woo! You got this! <laughs> You've got this. You've got this. Uh, Foundry and Roll20 are the primary VTTs. Gotcha. Okay. That's so cool. I've seen people play like play like Dungeons and Dragons and stuff. I have more letters? Exactly like that, Casey. Digging for gold is inefficient, but it can save you a pinch. The real income comes from having plants and items in the garden. You see, each natural item has its own magical note that we harness for garden tending. Some items are stronger than others. Since you are not magically attuned, we will use gold coins as an intermediate. The better garden you build, the more gold we can give you. Practical setup, isn't it? But more on income later. It is time for you to plant your first flowers. Hey, we have sourced you with one of your favorites, the yarrow. Oh, one of their favorites. Place a few now. Choose the item tool and select an item from the catalog. With an item selected, interact with a ground patch to place a new item. If the surface doesn't support your item or if the ground is blocked, you'll not be able to place it. Some items can be stacked. Ooh. Most surfaces and items have natural properties. Desi, welcome in. Um, surface properties mainly determine which items can be placed on a patch. An item can have both required and forbidden surface properties. Item properties work like surface properties, but are mainly used in building animal habitats. <gasps> can I get... Can I get animals too? Is this my journal? Okay, I wanna look at my journal. So here's my task. I have to place three items. These are all the letters I've gotten. Ooh, creatures. Oh, that's cool. Okay. How do I exit? Oh, just click. I didn't know what to do. So my, my flower. I place I can place it on either where I'm gonna place it I'm gonna place it by my house like one on each side of the house that's so cute okay I have to place three so we'll place we'll just place it there <laughs> this game is so cute so far but I'm gonna have to definitely check that out. Like I said, I've never played them. I probably won't play them, but I don't mind watching people. So let me let me drop you a follow real quick, Lily. Boop. Drop to follow. All right. You make it look effortless, Casey. We can't generate stuff out of thin air, so you need to provide us with gold for each item. Also, having too many items of a kind saturates its frequency. This means less gold for you, so go for variety when you can. Before we dig, hee hee, into the daily payout, you should probably know about item interaction. You can lift items and animals from the ground. Once held, an item can be manipulated and even sold. Perfect if you change your mind. Try selling a few items. If you would rather not sell your new plants, there should be old scraps lying about. Uh, with no tool selected, hold the interaction button to pick up items from your garden. When you hold an item, you can move it, sell it, and change its variation. When quickly pressing the interact button, some items such as the mailbox have special effects. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this flower. Can I not? Wait. Oh, there we go. Um. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm still working towards 500 followers, been going since 2020, but I've taken several hiatuses. So I actually started streaming back in 2019 on Facebook gaming, but when, um, so I was over there for most of 2020 and then about November, December, I switched over here. So I've been over here now for about two years, um, but I, like I said, because I am a flight attendant, I have taken some hiatuses myself. So I'm just trying to build myself back up again. Because <laughs> I had like over a thousand people over there on Facebook. But none, only a few of them followed me here. But that's okay. I'm doing, I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> 
I've heard mixed feelings from people about it. Yeah. My husband still streams over there, um, which he's actually on a hiatus right now. But he streams over there. Um, he's, he came over here with me, but then went back to Facebook because that's where his community was. That's where, like, the people that he plays with are. So he's doing pretty good. But I just, I just don't like the... I don't like the, like, the dashboard. Um, I don't like the fact that, like, you can't do any fun things like my channel point rewards. I need to add more, but there's some, like, there's some that, like, pop up overlays and stuff, which I can't do that over there. And I don't know what I would do if I couldn't do that. <laughs> Splendid. You free up room by selling an item and receive some gold to boot. But time flies and it is getting late. Let's wrap up the basics and retire. Our tiny hands are getting crampy from writing these letters. We spend the end of the day conjuring up gold coins from the garden energy. At dawn, you get a delivery of fresh gold to use just in time for breakfast. Ooh, I like breakfast. Oh, and we have attached a magical gizmo that shows the current day and its conditions. Now, wait until dawn when we'll be back. It does get rather dark at night, but you have nothing to be worried about. Nighty night. Feel free to continue gardening in the meantime. Um... Okay, so the journal contains various notes uh, from your journey, such as letters and tasks. The task tracker shows your currently tracked task, which you can change through the journal. Oh, okay, so I could change which task I want to have um, down at the bottom here. Finally, the time and weather gadget shows you environmental information and at night allows you to fast forward to dawn. I'm debating moving over to OBS from Streamlabs just because I like all the built-in features Streamlabs has. Yeah, so we started on Streamlabs when we first started streaming over on Facebook, and then we had a ton of problems, so we switched to OBS. So I've just been on OBS since. Um, look at my little notes. Council member. Council member. Council member. I have, like, three council members. How cute. Um, there we go. Okay, so Conjuration, 41.38. Uh, love bonus, 1%. Weather effect, 5%. Decay effect, 0%. Income, I made 43.79. Woo woo. Okay. I noticed that OBS takes up less memory. It does. Um, so some of the things that, like, you can get on Streamlabs, so you have, um, like, the different things you click on, most of those are just, like, browser sources. So, I mean... It's just adding them in easier than having to copy the link and paste it and all that stuff, which is what you do on OBS. But it's just all built into Streamlabs. So when you click on it, you're like you're adding it in as a browser source, but it's making it easier to add it. I don't know. I just that's what I remember. I know they've probably added more things, but. At dawn, the next day begins bringing new weather and a healthy payout of gold. Your progress is saved as well, indicated with the above icon. Okay, letting you continue where you left off at a later time. We'll let this go a little bit. I already switched over my chat overlay to stream elements because it's easier to modify. And that's too. And the thing is, you can use your Streamlab stuff on OBS. You just copy the browser source link. You could also use stream element stuff on Streamlab. So it's not like you have to only use Streamlab stuff or vice versa good morning and congratulations to your first completed day yay i completed the day that should cover the basics but there is yet a lot to learn and uncover on your horticulture journey horticultural journey however we will let you take the reins for now because today we have a task of our own you see as this world withered away most of our friends moved out good friends helpful friends we would like to send them a message of hope let them know we have found a new hortic horticular garden Guardian. So try out what you have learned, and we should be back tomorrow to teach you about animals. If you run out of money, there should be some challenges in your journal to pursue. Perfect. Edward! I'm off to lurk mode while I get my son to bed. No worries, faithful. I'll see you when you get back. Excuse me. Edward, welcome in. That is one of my favorite commands that I brought over with me from Facebook because I really enjoyed having a like command. So I have one here now. <laughs> Okay, so my tasks. Um, get rid of all waste in your garden. Yay! 
<laughs> have a hundred tiles of ordinary grass. Have ten thousand in the bank. Holy, holy gosh! <laughs> Complete five days. Okay, so let's try to, to get rid of waste. Um. All I oh, I was like, all I have are these, but I have so many more now. Plantain lilies. Moonshine. We got different. Oh. Why are these different but the same? Oh, this is like a bunch. Okay, that makes sense. Found your stand through Quilpy's Discord. Oh, I love Quilpy. I know Quilpy came over from Facebook too. Whatcha playing? So this game is called Horticular. It is a cute little. Let me try to pull up the game again. Um, I need. I should add it to this. Should add it to this. Um, it's a. Let's see. Relax a garden builder that begins with mysterious gnomes summoning you. Their wish for you to breathe new life into a long lost garden abandoned by its previous caretaker. So we're going to add that to the command as well. <laughs> Just because. There we go. Let's try that again. Game. There we go. Um, let me fix that real quick. <laughs> There we go. This is a relaxing game. Got it. Anyway, um, yeah, Quilpy came over from Facebook as well. Or probably around a little bit after I switched over. Honestly, I didn't even find her until she switched over, but I do know she switched from there. Um, I don't want to plant too much. Let's plant some moonshine. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, soil. I got to plant it on the soil. Okay. So we'll do that. I want like a stone or two. Okay. Um. Oh, dirt. Let's put some like right here. So that's going up. Do I gotta get this to a hundred? Oh, goodness. Okay. Okay. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I have an idea. We'll do that. There we go. Oop. It's so cute that it, like, does the little corners for you. That's adorable. Okay. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I just saw that she had a self-promotion channel, so I figured I'd give it a shot and get my name out there because I needed one more follower for my, um, oop for my followers <gasps> yes edward i forgot we reached 700 followers today how exciting okay um i don't know what else i'm supposed to do can i oh can i move this no <laughs> well happy to help no worries um should we get more flowers going more moonshine <laughs> we can fast forward to the morning yay we made money okay day three sunny breeze Animals only come during their active weather and time. That could mean rainy days or moonlit nights. What? Now it's back. Oh, must have been Twitch. <laughs> Cause I'm. It's everything's green on my side. I have no dropped frames. I have nothing. So it's probably on Twitch's side. That sucks. Anyways, we're getting bees. If you guys missed that, so we have to create a habitat for the bee. And then the bee should show up. So. 
Okay, tulips. Oh, bumblebee details. Let's go take a look. So flowery and shading. Sun, rain. Loves the sun, hates the rain. Between 7 a.m. and 9 p.m. And they need a 5 by 5 little area. Okay. Build a bumblebee habitat as detailed in your journal. Okay, well, let's get some tulips. Oh, do I need, I need soil, it looks like. Hold on. Is that what I need? I'm still learning here, guys. <laughs> it just says flowery and shading, so I guess I don't really need to... Twitch being twitchy. Yep. Hi, Jay. How are you? Welcome in. We're playing this new game. I'm going to put the bees over here. So it's four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So you got to make it all this big. That's going to be a big habitat. Holy cow. Doing okay. Just looking for different texture packs. Ooh. What you looking for? Okay. Let me see if I can add in some. I'm going to add in like some grass. We'll do like that. Maybe. Maybe it all has to be grass. I don't know. We're just going to put it all grass. Get some tulips going. I'm running low on money here. A Lego one? Oh, I didn't know they did Lego ones. What in the cute game is this? Also, hi. Hello, Dreamer. How are you? This is the game we're playing today. We got I got a free demo key from the developers. So, um, and I had to wait until after January 20th to play it. But obviously, I waited longer. <laughs> so we can play it now. Come on, hurry up, grass. I want to plant stuff. I want to plant stuff. You got your first asteroid. Forgot to do that. No worries. No worries. You could do that anytime during the stream. I want to actually... Um, I want to actually add some new things into my channel points. So... I'm going to add some sound effects soon. So hoping I can take care of that soon. <laughs> Hurry up. Hurry up. Okay. So tulips can't place it. What do you mean I can't place here? Do I have to have, like, a soil? Can I put them here? <laughs> Let's see. Okay, I could place them there. Cool. <laughs> I did it before the end of the day. Got my tulips. Um... They don't have really much. Um, journal. Shading. I don't. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So that's a five by five. Is it all supposed to be soil, maybe? We're going to try that. I know I'm wasting money doing this, but I don't know if I'm doing this wrong or not. <laughs> I have no idea. Maybe a stone or two. Can you tell me more about these, please? I wish it would tell me more. Can I? 
speed this up somehow. I don't know. Good day to you, Casey. My name is Aura, and tranquility has recently come to my attention. The Keepers and I go way back, and they have assured me that you will reclaim this land and bring it to its former splendor. I had a look and saw that you have already gotten started. Nothing spectacular, but you still have time. I guess aquatics happens to be a considerable interest of mine. No garden should be without a pond, so maybe you could add a pond to your garden. If you do, I think I could source you with the best items for our bubbly friends. <gasps> Oh, and I have attached pond water for you to use. Okay, cool. We can add a pond. I need to actually... Actually, you know what? I need... Whoa. Whoa, stop. <laughs> We're going to use tab for a second. Because I'm going to stop that timer. Let's see. Turn that off. We don't need that for this game. Do, 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 do. Come on. Ooh, look at the pond water. Okay, we're going to make a little pond over here. Like that. There we go. Cute little pond. <laughs> Hurry up. Um, that. Oh. What am I supposed to do? It's not considered a habitat now? I am so confused. Probably doing this all wrong. Oh well. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Simple and clean. Yes. But I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Like. Come on, little pond. Is it just this flowery? Like, am I supposed to add more flowers to it, maybe? Hmm. Oh. What do we do? You've got a lovely little habitat going. Oh, okay. As soon as you have an available habitat, curious animals will start showing up when the weather permits. It may take a little while, so be patient. See, that's what I was like. Maybe I should add more flowers. Your first game of it. Exactly. This is the tutorial, too. Um, when a curious animal pays you a visit, place it in its new home to have it move in. And with that, you have a new adorable inhabitant. Wait for and place a curious animal in your newly built habitat. Oh, and we have an additional task you can pursue while waiting. Collect 750 gold and we'll demonstrate something you will absolutely love. Okay. Once a curious animal arrives, you need to place it in its new home. Pick it up by holding the interaction button and place the, create the creature in an available habitat. Uh, for current residents, this process rehomes them instead. Okay. How am I going to know when a freaking bee comes if it's so small? I just got my little... So now is this a hab... Oh! Okay, so... Am I supposed to include the flowers? Let's see. Is that not considered part of it? Okay, whatever. Um, let's add... Can we add like a... No. It's not five by five, but whatever. <laughs> uh, none. Um, I'm so, so cute. Like, these little gnomes wandering around. Will it tell me if a bee shows up? Try a rock. Or 
Or like maybe a tulip? No. I thought I saw a bee. See, there's a. It just tells you that this is the thing. I don't know. Weird. Yeah, I don't know. Let's sell that. Maybe we'll try this now. Nope. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> we tried. Is that a fish? I think there's a fish in our pond. There's fireflies, though. More money. Oh, that's what it was. Yeah, I think it was just telling you that that was four bees. I don't know. Hi, Bree! Welcome in. Another challenge completed. Complete five days. Well done. Yay! More letters. A new carer for tranquility and thusly an emerging business opportunity for us both. My name is Mercury and I am well-established merchant of garden wares. I forged many a deal with your prod prod predecessor just as I now wish to do with you and eventually your successor. I have contacts in numerous worlds and can provide you with many a thing. New items to place, information, rumors, all with a suitable price tag in gold, naturally. Although my webs run wide, there is only so much I can keep track of at once. So every few days, I bring in new stock for you to peruse and buy. Do frequent so you don't miss a deal. You never know when it will return. Let's go see. So I have to um, add 25 pond water. So we're going to add... No. Oh, B, 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 B. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait. B, I did it. We got our first B. <laughs> How cute. The new creature is so adorable. You could rename it if you want. Something like Buzzy Buzz, perhaps. Anyhow, animals are not only a treat of life and tranquility, just like with items. Their presence emanate ancient energies. We hope an old friend will get in touch soon to show you more. Don't worry, be happy. <laughs> oh, and be warned. Animals eventually leave if they are unhappy, taking some time to return again. So remember the following. Some need food available. Your journal states which kind. Have shelters nearby in case of lousy weather. If you wreck a habitat, its resident may become homeless. Good luck finding new and uh, adorable inhabitants. I gotta add more um, pond. So how many is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Excuse me. We'll build that. Do a little pond over here. I don't know how many it's going to be, but there's another bee! Unless this is the same bee. Is this the same bee? That might be the same bee. Never mind. <laughs> Whoops. Why are you flying by the water? That's 72%. Maybe we can do, um, like a little pond right here. For the bees. It's being curious, yeah. Oh, look, it's the flowers. Oh my God. Probably needs a drink, either that or she is going fishing. Yeah, so that's why I put a little pond over by over by her little area. Uh, so how many is that? So one, so that was 12, right? And then 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 24, 25. Let's see if that does it. That did it. Perfect. Okay. 
That is a good start. Maybe I'll even provide a symbolic donation for the future of tranquility. But what is a pond without streaming water and juicy plants? I think I'll source you with both streaming water and water lilies. Oh, <gasps> pretty. Make good use of them. I got it at Walmart. In the in the gym section. It's the ath was it Athletic Works brand. Where's my camera? <laughs> Athletic Works. 14 bucks. $14, baby. Okay, let's just fast forward to morning so we can have it be daytime, right? It's not bad at all. So much cheaper than spending like $50 on a Hydro Flask. And I drink more water through a straw. <laughs> okay, let's see. Water lilies. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Water lily! <gasps> so cute! Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, some gold. We can. Oh, if I click, it just posts the whole thing. I was afraid to click. <laughs> now that you have some gold, <laughs> we can finally show you this golden tidbit. We're sure you have seen I been eyeing the waste surrounding tranquility. Don't you wish you could dig into all that unused space? Well, hold on to your hat. I'm not wearing a hat, but I'll hold on to my headphones. We can expand your garden and increase its build area. It takes a lot of energy to keep land fertile, so you'll need a bit of gold for the initial expansion. Additionally, each additional plot comes with operational costs, so don't go wild expanding needlessly. But we've covered the difference for your first one, so try expanding into a nearby plot. Ooh. I want that! That's so cute! I cannot wait till I could do stuff like that with mine. Okay, so zoom out fully to overview mode to manage your plots. Expand into adjacent plots, increasing the available area to fill with items and animals. Each expansion has a fixed cost, but also a daily upkeep. Should you keep, should the upkeep become too much, you can sell the plot again until you have more income. Okay. Um, stream... Oh, wait, do I, ha can I get rid of the other water? Like if I do that, it's like a stream. Add at least 10 tiles of stream water. So there's one stream and then we can stream that. So that's one, two, three, four, <clears throat> five. Hmm. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We need three more. One, two, and three. <laughs> Is that ten? Will that be it? I'm going to go rest. Still not feeling great, but enjoy this super cute game. No worries, Bree. I hope you feel better. I'm sorry you're not feeling good. Make sure you drink lots of fluids. Get some vitamin C in ya. What's this? Ooh, this is that shop he was telling me about. Oh, red velvet. Notable species of yarrow with a striking red color known to attract butterflies. Oh, <gasps> I love butterflies. Buy this item to add crow habitat information. I want, I want that. Um, we'll worry about the other stuff later, but I want red velvet. Red velvet. Okay. Is there, it's empty inside. Can I move it? I can move it. Can I turn it? Variation Q. Oh, there we go. Right next to the house, okay. I just wanna wait. Perfect, perfect. Let's fast forward and then we'll read. Aye aye, Captain, bye. <laughs> bye, Bree, please feel better. Please, please, please feel better. Next day. 
Now I'm trying to figure out is that 500 and something whatever is being added? Yes. Okay. That's cool. That's super cool. Wait, how much? 1% animals. <laughs> now that is what I call movement. Doesn't it make you feel alive? You probably know this already, but only certain aquatic plants thrive in streaming water. Just a heads up. Anyhow, I hope you like seeds because I do and I have got some for you. They make for a really good hiding place for animals. Ooh, reeds. Wait, does that go in the water? Can I put that in the water? Water. Uh, a tall grass-like aquatic plant that grows in up to one millimeter deep water. Edible for animals and can be used for grazing. I will return shortly. No worries, Edward. Enjoy your lurky loo. I'm trying to just find a place to put it. Let's put it there. And we'll put one over over here too. Um, expand it. Okay. How do I expand? How do I expand? Have at least 10 water lilies. Can do. We'll at least do that. So water lilies can't go on the stream water, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Uh, really makes your garden feel more like home and cozy. Let's see if you can keep it up. I'm giving you a sizable donation so you could take tranquility even further. More gold. Um, how do I expand? Oh, like this. Oh, oh, I just didn't have enough gold. A thousand. Which way do we want to go? Okay, what's over here? Kind of like this tree thing. There's one closer down here. Maybe we go down. Once we have more, we'll go down. Doop, doop. Okay. Um. Can't do that yet. Um. All the waste. Is that all the waste? Not yet. <laughs> but we'll just fast forward, whatever. Go to sleep, Mr. B. Oh, it's rainy! Wait, where'd my bee where does my bee go when it's raining? Weather has an impact on your garden. Not only does it cause wear and tear. 28 days later, Dev seems to be a fan of zombie movies. We actually just started watching, um, well, I mean, there's only two episodes, but we just watched um, The Last of Us. Have you guys watched it? Um, I, I believe the episodes come out every Sunday, I think, is when the new episodes come out. It's such a great show, I know. We're excited. I'm not usually one for zombie stuff, but... It's a great show. It makes me want to play the game now. <laughs> Do I own it? I might own it. I don't know. Could have been one of those free games on PlayStation Plus. <laughs> uh, to tap into its magic. While a stormy day may hinder us, a calm and sunny one may even provide a bonus. There's not much you can do to control the weather, but you can try to work around its effects instead. Okay. I don't know what that means, but whatever. Um, I'm not going to buy anything from you yet because I want to expand. Are we going this way? Yeah, we're going to go this way. <gasps> Look at it. Okay, because I want to... I want to... A goldfish? <gasps> we got a goldfish! Ah! Encapsulates the first game really well. Does it? Okay, I'm excited now. We got a goldfish, you guys! It's so cute! Okay, we have two letters. 
You've expanded into a rocky patch. Unfortunately, your gardening shovel may not be capable of digging into the rocky ground just yet. So you will have to live with the rockiness for now. In the meantime, we're certain you can be creative and make it pretty. Would you find a way to dig up the rocks, however, provide us with a sample? We should be able to source more of it so you can add some rockiness to tranquility. Okay. And uh, extra space just waiting to get reclaimed and prettified is the first step of many. Before long, you will have a huge sprawling garden. Like that first bit pre-apocalypse made me cry just as hard as the game did. Did it? Oh. I'm currently playing through um, Fallout 4. And then I need to also jump into the second game of Uncharted. So I have all these games now to play. And that's why I'm a variety streamer, because I like different games. <laughs> um, we attach some gold to get you started. Okay. So I can't go through this, but what did you give me? What do I have? Oh, a fence. Oh, cool. And then we got grass. This gives shade. Oh, shoot. Go this way. We're going to put some grass in here for the bee. Um, let's see. Let's do... It's not going to work. Do that. And then pond here. Like that. I think. Sure, that looks good. <laughs> Fallout 4 was fun. Yeah, I'm currently, we just, in the last stream, we went to, um, we found Diamond City and we were exploring it. I just splashed water on myself. <laughs> I opened the straw because there's a button and it flung water in my face. <laughs> hmm. We'll do more pond over here. As much pond as we can. <laughs> and I gotta expand it once more. I want... So 400,000? Are you kidding me? Jesus. Okay. Slow clap. How long have I been muted? <laughs> How long has it been like that? Oh my goodness. <laughs> now, I was saying that um, a slow clap like command is actually pretty cool. That's probably something that I would love to have seen in someone's stream. Uh, but I was saying I could make one that's just like a gif of like a slow clap that pops up on the screen, but... Um, I still haven't even gotten rid of all the waste. Is that not all waste? Oh, there's a pond over here. What are you? What is that? I don't even know what that is. Nope. 
Have, how do, have I not gotten rid of all the waste? I don't know what else would be considered waste. <laughs> I'd be willing to record a custom slow clap sound for you. <gasps> that might be cool. The froggy is in the... Oh my god, he lives in the little tulips. How are you walking on water? You're weird. That would be awesome. Do you do do you do things like that a lot? Like record sound effects and stuff? Rainy wind. <gasps> okay. Uh this is tranquility, which would make you Casey? Curious. I don't sense much magic around. Surely you have attained some garden upgrades by now. Forgive me. My name is Faunus, and my specialty is condensing creature magic into novel upgrades. Upgrades that take gardening to the next level. The keepers might have mentioned me. You may have been taught the basics, but a true horticular prodigy will upgrade their garden. So I suppose I'll be helping you with upgrades from now on. By attracting new animals, I'll be able to make you upgrades for a small sum of gold. Okay. Sometimes. That's so cool. I've been wanting to do, like, sound effects and, like, make my own, um, like, alert sounds and stuff. I'm trying not to splash myself with water. <laughs> I happen to notice that your garden is more extensive than before. You must have expanded recently. You know what? I think you should have ample room for even more lilies now. Do you not? If you can increase the count a bit more, I have a unique lily that you... Ooh, okay. So we're going to come down here. And we're going to make... Some, oh. Soil. We're going to make another six. Another goldfish? Look at that! I'm getting all sorts of animals today. Um, okay, so now let's do some more dirt around here. I'm just trying to make this look somewhat nice. Can we just do grass for the rest of it, maybe? Oh, shoot. Can I undo? How do I undo? How do I undo? Whatever. So what happens when you move too fast? There we go. That's what I've been trying to do. Um, a unique me. Yay. I'll be lurking, listening, going to play some Minecrafties. No worries. Enjoy the Minecrafties. Oh, wait. Were those supposed to be... Dang it. That was supposed to be stream, huh? Whatever. Okay. Flowers. What'd she say? Lilies. What is it? Water lilies. Okay, water lilies. There's, um, more space over here. Am I supposed to just have a ton of wool? <laughs> okay, we're going to make this part pond, I guess, as well. Just do all that. <laughs> Slow and steady wins the race, hun. I know. I know. I was just trying to be more productive. <laughs> I was just trying to be productive. And that didn't out as well as I had hoped. <laughs> You're hiding in there now too? We're gonna add one more here. And we'll just fast forward to the morning. <laughs> Productive or destructive? Kidding, kidding. <laughs> no, it's true though. I either do productive things or I, uh, I did it again, or destructive. <laughs> oh. Okay, wait. Honestly, I'm still trying to determine how this one works, but you will dig faster. 
Uh, I can recalibrate your shovel's gold sensitivity. Uh, magical reinforcement. Your spade should be able to unearth harder materials. I like that. I want that one. Am I supposed to... Oh, I need two frogs. Okay. Um, land expansions are 15% cheaper. That's nice. What's this? You could use temporal magic to refurbish items to an earlier state, retaining more value when you sell them. That sounds fun. Um, oh, dragonflies? I like dragonflies. Why aren't you moving? Oh. Hold on. Did my st <laughs> Did my stream? <laughs> Hold on. Why is this not working all of a sudden? It <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> you broke it. Okay, why aren't you moving? In game. Left. What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> it's not even showing like it's not working. It's just not working. Oh my god. Okay, well. There. So, <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Um, so, yeah, over there. So, it says what what it is, and then at the bottom, the requirements. So, the one that I want, which is Geologist 1, um, I need to get one more frog for that. Um, I need one koi fish for this one um, to get 10% few requires 10% fewer animals. Uh, six frogs? Oh my gosh. Garden will magically become more outstanding by redirecting some animal energy into an ambient love field. How cute. I want this one, though, so... My steam jack just not working. Why couldn't you be a koi? Thank you. I still don't know why this isn't working. <laughs> it's not where it's supposed to be, but whatever. Okay, now we have a fishy over here. Oh, we need more water lilies. That's all stream. Did I put the wrong one? I sat up. I know with my stream deck, sometimes I have to reinitialize things between PC rubies. Well, that's, that's what, but it worked before. That's the thing. I don't understand. <laughs> this was supposed to all be pond. Not that. <laughs> oh, wait. Okay. So we were going to do the red velvets. No. What were we going to put? Um, I need a hundred tiles of ordinary grass. So if I just come in here and just put grass everywhere else. What? Who's unhappy? One of your creatures is currently unhappy. Make sure to check in on it to see what it needs. Um... Why are you unhappy? Um, okay, weird. Uh, <laughs> welcome back. Um, I don't get, because you shut it off earlier. Right, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, I just used them earlier, and now they're not working. That makes me wonder, is anything working? Okay, that works. I don't know. Now does it work? Nope. The captions don't even want to work either. 
whatever. I'm probably gonna like end the stream and they're just gonna like freak out because they just like. <laughs> I have an idea. Hold on. I'm gonna like make this smaller. Maybe that'll help so you guys can see down at the bottom over there because that's where the um the task is and you guys couldn't see it before. Hold on. I could just boop, move the captions up. That'll work. <laughs> I don't know what is going on here. There's too much stuff here. Okay, no, I liked it smaller. I don't know. Oh my god, it's a new day. It's a new day, but it all feels old. It's a good life, that's what I'm told. Okay. Um, manual like a plebe. <laughs> I just, I don't know why it's not working today. Mercury has new goods. Still can't do that. Ooh, sand? Stones, moths. I want dragonflies. I don't want moths. <laughs> How many water lilies do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. It's only twenty-one. I don't want more than that. Um, cattails are fun. I thought the game was talking about the planet. <laughs> <gasps> okay hold on there's cattails i can't afford them rude but we're gonna just do more grass i guess because i have to get like a hundred pieces of grass anyway so we just put grass all here Let's do this. I'm spending so much money, but. Or unless I'm finding money. Does... I don't think this actually costs me anything, so never mind. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Move. Oh, he's stuck. <laughs> I'm sorry, little man. I'm sorry. Can I pick him up? No. Well, looks like you're stuck now, sir. Well, anyway. <laughs> My little froggy. You've trapped him! I did! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! And they won't let me pick him up. Oh, well. Oh, well. <laughs> no way out. <laughs> That's cute. I like that. No way out. <laughs> Does look like you can show them love, though. Yeah, so I'm giving... I'm like, look at all the hearts. That's cute. Okay, we gotta do... Where's the other guys? He's in, like he's in the flowers. Can I give, oh, I could do that too. <gasps> Bumblebee, where, where? Bumblebee. Oh, shoot. Wait, can I not? Wait, can I not? Do I have to literally make a new habitat for each one? Well, that's stupid. Who's decaying? Well, <laughs> danger, danger. Um, I like how your entire focus went to the bumblebee. <laughs> Hey, that's what ADHD does, okay? 
<laughs> it is happening again, Casey. Tranquility is decaying unnaturally fast, just like it did after Nightshade's disappearance. If left unmanaged, your plants and items will wither and crumble, turning the surface into waste. Calm down. Don't panic. This is exactly why we have been preparing magically infused gardening gloves to deal with situations like these. They are not ready for full operations yet, but we have no choice. Try them out. Restore your decaying items. Oh, I already deleted it. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Magic is your main method of gardening. Hi, Stuart. Whoops. <laughs> It lets you heal animals, deal with decaying items, and ward off unwanted elements. Hold the interaction button and select a charge tier. All tiers come ne consume nectar, except for the slow-charging basic tier. If you don't have the nectar, you can gamble by consuming what you can afford. Oh, okay. Well. Uh, we kept our heads cool and addressed the situation. But to see decay after only 12 days before we even had time to teach you about it, what an unlucky lucky whoa 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 unlucky turn of events it almost feels intentional normally you can expect decay from wear and tear such as rough weather but with your new gloves you should be set to deal with it our friend fauna should be able to help unlock their full potential too regardless we probably should start searching for garden tending assistance we'll get back to you on that one soon Ooh, i got gloves well i put too much How do I speed it up? <laughs> uh, carefully aligning the spiral micro crystals. I will make your gloves charge faster than ever. I will expand your storage buffers by reusing existing energy. Nope, still doesn't work. That should give you access to grander magic. Excuse me. Um, nectar cost for using magic is reduced by 20%. You also forgot this one. <laughs> but thank you, Stuart, for catching that burp. Um, I still don't want to do any of those. Can you hurry up? How much? 90%. We're almost done. Can you go any slower, though? Come on. This bee doesn't have a home. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm going to watch Princess and the Frog. <laughs> How's the game? The game's good, honey. It's cute. It's adorable. Learning new things. Making little gnomes not be able to move because I trapped them. <laughs> Can't afford to expand. So, yeah. But it's fun. Challenge complete. What did I complete? A hundred tiles. Yes. What is that? Thicket? What is thicket? The ground of densely concentrated area of trees. Does it put trees or do I have to just put it under trees? But yeah, watch it. Watch it. Um, I don't want that one. Where's all the waste? I guess we'll get rid of waste as this builds. <laughs> hey there. Hi there. Ho there. So at night, it fast forwards. So more things go, which is nice. But doesn't help us now. Uh, new gardener. Are you a nectar officiato like me? Judging from your collection, not so much. My name is Corbett, and I am both a collector and connoisseur of items and nectar. Not only that, but I have found to trade nectar for items, sometimes even gold. You know what? If you would collect some nectar of any kind, I'll open up my services to you. I assure you that you won't regret it. As a resource you could pick up, Ooh. drops during moonlit nights from fully, ap wait, fully adapted flowers... Uh, creature nectar drops now and then from happy animals or when one eats a moon nectar. The third is unsavory element. Oh, okay. A measure of natural items settling in and increases item value, affecting daily income and selling price. 
The longer an item stays in the same spot, the more adaptation it has. When you move an item, it loses some adaptation. A longer distance leads to more adaptation lost. Okay, cool. Uh, I've never seen it, and they are re-theming Splash Mountain to it, so I should probably see it. You should, honey. I've only ever seen it maybe once or twice myself, but you're trapping gnomes? I did it on accident. I didn't mean to. Um, but yeah. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. Okay. I'm waiting for another froggy, though. I want another froggy. Do, do, do. Can I afford this yet? Should we go? I think I want to go this way. And then we can get the gnome over there. <laughs> Wait, what's happening? So much life, space, and magic. Your efforts haven't gone unnoticed, Casey. What's happening? <laughs> Thanks to you, we have more magic to harness than in a long time. Is it the end of the demo? This used to be a glorious and sprawling world. Plants thriving and animals frolicking. The source of the splendor was Nightshade, our guide. But problems started when Nightshade mysteriously vanished. Plants decaying. Our homes crumbling. And the animals leaving, never to be seen again. Unnaturally fast, our world turned into a barren wasteland. Since we are natural maintainers... Maintainers. Why did I say maintainers? <laughs> I missed it. So we used our final strength to reach out for help and found you. With our newfound energy, we have reestablished ourselves as the council. Your council, Casey. And we help you with the following tasks. Turn the wasteland into a flourishing garden. Create a thriving animal ecosystem. And protect us from whatever befell the previous gardener. Now, there was something else. Something important. We'll send you a letter once we remember. <laughs> Thank you, Edward. <laughs> Maintainers! <laughs> we can... We'll add that. <laughs> okay. Go, go in. Cool. He's out of the way now! Oh, he left. Boo. Okay, well, we, we need to add a piece of grass there now. And pick up all this. Nope, that's it? Okay. He's free! He is free! Look, come over here, little mans. I don't know what I can do with my house. Can I pick it up? I can't even pick it up. Boo. Free the gnomes! Free the gnomes! <laughs> okay. Now come over here before I lock you in again. Somehow. Um, let's see. Most of it's done now. More money, more money. Aw, rainy. I don't like it when it's rainy. Ooh, Hortic Day. Every now and then, garden masters from many worlds get together in a grand hort hort horticultural event. We call it the Hortic Day, and it is organized by a few old keepers. Very old. In fact, we are not sure how old they are. Probably ancient. In the festivities, each garden master is ranked on their performance. This part is where you will eventually be crowned a legendary horticulturist. There's also a themed competition to win prizes and a medal ceremony for accomplishing specific feats. The first event is coming up, but you need a high garden love to stand a chance. So make sure to have a good garden love foundation before the event takes place. Your garden love is combined score of the garden's quality. Increased, increase it by using new items and surfaces, keeping the garden varied, attracting animals, especially new species, expanding the garden. More love means a better income bonus and a higher Hortic Day score. Okay. Hey, wait, what is this? Oh, here we go. 
What is this? Oh, look what I did! <laughs> so this is our love, I think, right here. So 29. Ta-da! I'm going to try this. <gasps> so it just does... Okay, so we're almost done with this now. Still doesn't help much, though. <laughs> Just finish already. Um, still can't do anything there. Let's see. Sand, stones, still can't afford cattails. But I want to. We're going to build some water over here, I think. Oh, we need thicket. So we'll do some thicket over here. Okay. No. Oh! The new hope within gardening. Somehow TM. <laughs> Hyperbole. But it does seem that sudden decay hasn't stopped your progress. Unfortunately, that means I have to escalate my efforts. Yes, I am behind your recent stint with decay. However, I only pursue the eradication of tranquility. It would be a shame if anything happened to you as well. So go back to where you came from, or you will be an obstacle in my path. And you don't want to be an obstacle, do you? From now on, I am your nemesis. Ooh, we have a nemesis now. Uh, who is that nemesis character? What about them being the sudden decay? Does that mean they were involved with disappearance of your predecessor too? This is not good, Casey. Not good at all. We will have to dive into our library over the day to see if the written word can shed any light. But don't be afraid. We will protect you from whatever Nemesis tries. Just keep on gardening. <laughs> oh no. Oh shoot. Okay. He looks like an evil cat. He did. What is that? Wait. Oh, do I not have enough something or other? Uh, overloaded your gloves. Oh, if you do not have enough nectar for the magic level, your gloves will overcharge and try to cast the magic anyways. However, this is at a chance of overloading your gloves, needing some time to recharge. While recharging from an overload, your gloves are unusable. No! Whatever. And there's some there too. <sighs> I don't know what... I wish I could, like, add more houses and stuff. How do I perform a magical upgrade? I don't know how to do a magical upgrade, so... Not gonna worry about that. Still didn't work. Oh well. Guess my gloves are overloaded. Oh. How do I perform a magical upgrade? Teach me. Um, I still don't know where all the waste is. Okay, let's see if we can dig up anything yet. Oh wait. Ground too hard, ground too hard. Nothing. Okay. Well, <laughs> can't do that yet. Um, how many days are we at? I don't even know. I don't even know. Let's... Oh, how do I get nectar again? Can I move him? Is that the only place he can live? It's the only place he can live. So we're going to put some water over here. Doop. Hi, Slandry. How are you? Think you have to upgrade your tools to the one creature for the magical upgrade. Yeah. I still can't do it.
Let's see. Is there just not enough flowers, maybe? No. No. I just don't have a place for this bee. So never mind. <laughs> We've gone through plenty of reading and we got nothing. Well, we gleaned some things. From our logs, your predecessor had mysterious correspondence in the days leading up to the disappearance. It could be that this nemesis scared them off like in your letter. Or even worse, nemesis might have performed an abduction. Oh my goodness. We can't know for sure yet, but we'll keep digging. Please do. It is about to rain. I... Dig faster. More gold. I need one more frog. Just send me one more frog, please. Uh, lightning struck. You are in no immediate danger, but if you are unlucky, a strike can hit one of your items and cause a lot of wear and tear. In general, lightning occurs during thunderstorms, so most of the time you do not have to worry, but keep your eyes open. Oh, oh no. Okay, so I got to place more. Oh, what is that? I need to go that way. Um, water lilies. I was like, what am I doing? And then I need some reeds. Do, do. Fast forward. <gasps> One corrupted. Wait, what does that mean? If you did not notice it yet, there are corrupted elves in the garden. Just use your magical gloves on them like with decay. Stay calm, now go. Okay, wait. What does that mean? What does that mean? I don't know what that means. <laughs> well, this just took a turn for the dark, right? Why isn't it working? Oh, there we go. Corrupt keeper details. Uh, yesterday, we were contacted by some of our fellow keepers. They wondered if now would be a good time to settle in tranquility. Truth be told, we don't think so because they wouldn't have anywhere to live. So we source you with a home for them. Just place in a cottage in the garden and a keeper will eventually appear. Just like other animals, us keepers need to be kept happy. In addition to the basics, a keeper also has unkeep, upkeep. But in return, they wander about tending the garden and preventing decay. Oh. Uh, cooler heads prevailed again. These corrupted elves that you encountered haven't been s seen in eons. We must admit that we thought they were fairy tales. Um, invented to get younglings to do their chores. Supposedly, the corrupted elves stem from an original corruption, an ancient source of evil that wishes to stop life from propagating. Unfortunately, we don't know much about the corruption itself, but its minions are basically the antithesis of us keepers. Instead of tending to nature, they intend to destroy it. Oh my goodness. The keepers deems that these corrupted minions are probably working for a master, and who other than Nemesis? Could Nemesis be the corruption embodied? Probably. Oh, cute! We'll just do like two for now. So if I just get rid of the corrupted things, no. Okay. Oh my goodness. That didn't work. Rude. Okay then. Um... We'll just sell them. How about that? 
<laughs> Cute little bee. I'm going to build you a little habitat, okay? I'm going to build you a habitat, I promise. He left. <laughs> is this Roller Coaster Tycoon? No, it is not. It's a mystery that may never be solved. Exactly. It's called Horticular. Um, what else can we do? Like a little stone and then... We got a keeper. We got a keeper. Okay. More keepers mean more company for us and more assistance for you. This is a big step for us, Casey. When we summoned you, we didn't care. We didn't dare dream about the day that our numbers would be increasing. With more keepers comes a better ability to tend the garden and harness its magic. We keepers are also known as elves or gnomes and inhabit most fertile wards. War what? What? <laughs> Worlds. In fact, we even have relatives back in yours, but they seem to primarily keep hee hee to themselves, and their helping hands have to become have now become forgotten. He's so cute. Do you think that's enough for a? For a habitat? So that's a goldfish habitat. I don't think that's big enough. Bumble... Oh, it's showing me who does live here. Okay, so bumblebee, goldfish, goldfish. That's not included, I guess. Oh, a bumblebee. Is that my bumblebee? Wait, what? They're saying a bumblebee can live here? Oh, I got a nectar. Is this all nectar? Oh, there's water nectar too? Okay. Well, we just picked up nectar. Cool. Let's fast forward. <laughs> it reminds me of Farmville. Right? It's so cute, isn't it? What did he just do? What do you do? Oh, he's, he goes in the water. He's adorable. Got some more nectar going. Where? 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 Down here? Over here? Cute. What are you doing? Where? Is that your house? Okay, that's his house now. <laughs> they keep my stuff alive! That's cute! Is this maybe not big enough, maybe? So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So we'll just do that. We're gonna add some more uh, flowers. Some grass, maybe? Uh, moonshine. An unknown. I can polish your arcane amplifiers to allow for more significant magical impact. Do you got more stuff for me? Still can't afford the cattails. <laughs> but there's yellow tulips. There's this um, bigger moonshine. I want to get this deck. I want the deck. Oh, shoot. I wish I could zoom out without zooming out that far. Um, we're just going to put another one there. Because you never know. Mm 
And then we'll add a little paw, like, ooh. Um, and then we'll add some stream here. There. Let's do that. And then we'll pick up all of this. Thank you. Is that it? That's cute. Okay. You must have some top secret access. This game isn't out yet on Steam. I did get a, a key for it from the developers. So... So, yes, indeed. Is there any more? Nope. Oh, we'll fast forward a little bit. Um, yeah, so I did get a demo key for it from the developers. Um, the game itself comes out some point this year. Make sure you do add it to your wish list, though, because that will help with the developers as well. That's nice of them for giving you a key. Me too. I'm, a, I'm excited that I got to try this game out. So far, I'm liking it. So far, I really do like it. Hurry up. <laughs> I want another frog. Just still not considered a habitat? Why not? More maybe just more um more flowers, maybe. Maybe I just need more flowers. Here we go. Ha ha! I did it. <laughs> it's always the flowers. It's always the flowers. Cool. Maybe I'll just make this little area like for them and like move them around and stuff. That'd be cool. But now we got another bee. I'm going to put like a rock here. And I want to do some dirt around it. Oh, shoot. And then I'm going to add more pond here. Now I got to put stupid rock again. <laughs> you can never have enough flowers. No, you cannot. I really wish I had trees. Just sell the decay. That's all I gotta do, right? Just sell the decay. Put some more water lilies down here, maybe. Oh, I can only do one. Now I'm out of money. I ran out of money so fast. Wonder what it would be like to own an actual farm? <gasps> I don't know. That'd be kind of fun, though. That will be kind of fun. Let's see. Uh, recalibrate your shovel's gold sensitivity and uh, whatever that is. Or sell sell items at thirty percent of its original value. So thirty percent more. Oh no! Okay, I do got to stretch <laughs> because I haven't stretched yet. So let's let's do a little bit of stretching real quick. I really need to. I really need to. Oh. And a hydrate. <laughs> okay, we're going to stretch. You can't see my head. <laughs> Is it blurry for you guys? Because it was blurry. 
free for me. Feel free to stretch with me. <laughs> I need a stretch camera. That's what I need. Just a separate camera for the stretching. My pants rolled down. Don't look at my belly. <laughs> I am, I know. <laughs> What'd you say? I don't have enough room to stretch in front of my computer. Honestly, I never used to. <laughs> we moved and so now our room is bigger. Okay. Okay. It's enough stretching. <laughs> That's enough stretching. But like I said, I want to get another webcam to have for my stretching. I would stretch, but I don't want to. <laughs> Still unpacking three months later, so there are boxes everywhere. Honestly, so we moved in here in September... And um, we moved into my mom's house in September. And I think we just cleaned up the boxes that were in here the beginning of this month. <laughs> so this whole background right now that I have is not what was here for pretty much the entire time we've lived here until this month. So, <laughs> but um, okay. You better get ready because tonight we come. This time, tranquility will become a mere memory of its former self. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, wait. We should add. Oh, I can't afford it. Rude. Oh, well. Can't afford anything. Really. I spent all my money. Digging treasure to gold. I'll update grade that. Sure, why not? <gasps> oh, that's just excellent. Got a bit cozier. Can you feel the increase in magic? As I said previously, each upgrade requires unique animals in your garden. Once I performed an upgrade, it is locked in and will stay. However, should your animals leave, you must attract new ones to unlock further upgrades. Okay. I should be able to provide more upgrades than I can offer now, but I'll have to work on that. Maybe you'll find them in your work. I will probably need some assistance in the future, but for now, good luck breathing life into your garden. Okay, so we did that. <laughs> I'm... Progress, geez, geez. Thank you, Stuart. I'm still waiting for my dad's old roommate to move most of his crap out of the basement I moved into, plus a good portion of the back room is cluttered with my dad's stuff. Oh, no, why are you unhappy? I'm gonna give you my love. Give me my lovings. Bumblebee? Do I have enough space for you? Probably not. Yes, there's a home right here. <laughs> Apparently these are considered habitats too. I didn't know that. So we're going to get some flowers in the other one. Do I have money? I do. Only two. <laughs> two is better than none. How do I make you unhappy? Or how do I make you not unhappy? My goldfish left! No! One of your creatures left the garden. I did the box thing so many times. Yeah. How do I make you unhappy? <laughs> We're going to add that too. We're adding that because apparently <laughs> one of your creatures left the garden. It is likely that you accidentally modified its habitat, making it unhappy. When your habitants get too unhappy, they leave. Once that happens, attracting new animals will temporarily take longer. Anyhow, don't be discouraged. You have lots of success ahead of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I need like... Um... Nope. Hmm. Anything 
that doesn't need soil. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. We'll just fast forward the night. Um, this game is inspiring so many great quotes, right? Wait, what happened? What just, wait, 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 wait. You did it. Very well, Casey. I hereby open up my services to you. Please come by and trade anytime. I have wares that Mercurius wouldn't even dream of acquiring. Karha! <laughs> I have heard that an illusor illusory corrupted nectar. I don't know where you would find them, but I would love to trade them for you. Okay. Sir! Oh, okay. <laughs> this game. <laughs> Why? No, I gotta do it now during the day, I think. Does that do it? Do I just need to do it the one time? I don't know. Oh. I got a nectar out of that. Okay. <laughs> Weird. Okay. Ooh! These are cute. This is cute. Okay. Barrel cactus. Coffee maker. Boots. These are so cute. I could buy keepers too. Tile. Stone steps. Oh my god. These things are so cute. Okay. Can't buy anything yet though. You need to do it three times. Okay. That I think that's what we figured out last time, but I thought maybe I just, I don't know. My goldfish doesn't have a friend. It's like a little pathway for the froggy. That's so cute. Um, we're only at 32. What do I need to do? Size, animals, other. What is other? I don't know what other is. Should we add more grass? Can we add more grass? I don't want to trap anybody. Don't trap anybody. Come on, buddy, go. I don't want to trap you. There's a way down here now, so he's not trapped. I did not trap him. <laughs> Coffee maker, hands down. I know, right? Oh. What just happened? Was it freaking Twitch being a Twitch again? Rude. <laughs> okay. Um. Nectar. Oh. No, no, no. Dirt. Let your hands not have anything in it, Casey. <laughs> it's a nectar over there. Okay. Let's fast forward. I don't know. I just mod here. Hurry, the gnome won't get trapped. <laughs> I did not trap him this time. I think you guys can do the... Um... The ad quote. Let me see. Yeah, any one of you guys can do ad quote. It's just exclamation point, ad quote, and then space, and then whatever I said. So you guys can add all these quotes to my quote thing. Um, nectar, 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 
No nectars over here. Nope. Okay, I do need more red velvets, so. though. There we go. <laughs> That's dangerous. <laughs> I, I'm i very generous, okay, you guys? <laughs> um, I am going to put a cooldown on it, though. So now there's a cooldown. I think it, I put 60... What was that, minutes? I think that's 60 minutes or 60 seconds. So a minute? Sure. How did it go down? Rude. Are you almost done? Almost done. There we go. Do that. Um, my reeds. Why is everything going wrong? Or going dead, whatever. Do, 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 do. Fast forward. <laughs> You click checking out all of the uh uh all of the things. <laughs> going dead and going wrong are pretty much the same thing. Yeah, yeah. I think it's a 60 second cooldown, so every minute, but I could be wrong, I don't know. Oh, that was a big nectar. That was two nectars in one. All of the commands, you bet your butt. <laughs> I use Mix It Up Bot for all of my things. Mix it up. Hold on, let me see some. I think I have... Yeah, it's 60 seconds. Um, yeah, I have mixed it up. I am a mix it up ambassador too, by the way. I don't think I have a command for that. Nope, I do not. That's cool. Anyway, resume. <laughs> I want to put some shade, like over here. <gasps> I don't have any more money. Whatever. Just for my little, my little bee he has some shade. They're eating all the stuff. Okay, I got to add more lilies, but I have no money. <laughs> Um, I don't have any of these things. Yeah, 60 minutes would be 3,600. Yeah, okay. Add you? I'm a free lily. <laughs> You're a free lily. Okay. Yeah, they're 50. I wish I could. My sound alerts are not working, and I don't know why. So, uh, I apologize for that. Let me... Do-do-do... It would help if I typed the right word. <laughs> I don't know why it never works. 
I was doing some reading on the origins of gnomes recently. It is speculated their name might come from the Greek genomis, which translates to earth dweller. That's cool. Come on. Yeah, yeah, I read your terms and service. Okay. Why is it not working? There we go. There we go. I had it muted. <laughs> I had it muted in my sound, in my um, Wavelink software. I'm sorry, you guys. Or in my OBS, it was muted. But there it is. It is not muted anymore. Let's unmute that one, too. <laughs> what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's been a while, okay? Okay. I have no money. I love recess. <laughs> recess was one of my favorite shows growing up. Any more? Getting all the nectar. So show, I have one red nectar, 19 green, and five yellow. Mm, okay, I could buy and sell nectar? That's pretty cool. That's cool. We're just gonna fast forward the deal. <laughs> Yours too? Yes. I love recess so much. Mercury has new geodes. New new goods. I said geodes. What? I'm not playing Stardew Valley. You better get ready because tonight we come. This time, tranquility will become more mere memory of its former self. Well, what am I supposed to do? Hmm? Let's pick up all the nectar. We'll just sell those. Nectar, nectar. You guys don't drop nectar, do you? <laughs> okay, let's see. We have 800. I want to finish this water lily thing. So let's... Let's click on it. do 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 Nothing there. I don't have money. Okay. Well, close enough. <laughs> Getting closer. I gotta love on them. I gotta love them all. Love them all. Level up. Thank you guys so much for all the biddies. I love that show. Yeah, it's such a good show. I gotta love you! Let me love you! <laughs> What's decaying? I wanna love all my little gnomies. Anything else? Nope. Okay. Just fast forward. Fast forward the night. <gasps> Too corrupted. No. I 
I should try to get them both together. Gotta do it all by myself. Gotta do it all. Oh, he turned into... Okay, so we gotta get him for the third time. Oh, he disappeared. Oh, well. At least we got him. At least we got him. Honestly, though, I'm enjoying this game a lot. It's, like, cozy, but not cozy. It's so weird. Nectar. Any more nectar? I don't see any. <gasps> Papa Bee! Over here. That's your new home. But I want to finish my water lilies. 91. Oh my god. <gasps> I did it! Water lilies make a wonderful scene. And you have so many of them. Did you know that animals can walk on them? Could come in handy at some point. I'll be providing you with Victoria lilies from now on, along with a small donation so you can try them out. <gasps> Ooh. Big old Victoria lilies. Look at that. No more? <laughs> Can't afford it. Well, I got one. <laughs> cool. Can I... Can I, oh, come on. Can I get grass? I cannot. That's okay. Um, trade in nectar for 15 plus percent more gold. I don't want to do that. Can't afford that. They have purple tulips too. So many cute things in this game. Oh, that was way too close. <laughs> I just want one more frog. Give me one more frog, please. That's all I want. It's just one frog. One frog. <laughs> okay. Um. My lips are so chapped. These are all done already? Holy crap. Where's all the waste? I don't know where the waste is. Can you show me where all the waste is? <laughs> Let's see. Can we just put... Hmm. Nectar, nectar. That's it. Unless they're talking about, like, this stuff. Like, is this waste, maybe? That might be considered waste. Frog! <sighs> How much did we get? 1.6k? 1.6k? I just need another frog. That's all I need. You have my attention. You clearly show some dedication to the aquatic arts. However, I have something in mind that displays a further appreciation of aquatics. I want you to provide a home for five or more frogs in your garden. You will need some aquatic space... I am sure. Frogs have small nesting areas and need access to water, plants, and basking. I think you can figure out the details. Accomplish this, and you have not just shown that you can handle water, but also that you can provide a habitat for aquatic fauna. In return, you will receive a gift your frogs will love. Okay. Will do. Will try to do, at least. <laughs> okay, so if we come here, go here... So it needs no koi. So we don't have koi. It needs shade. So let's get some... Oh. Let's get some shade. Um, shelter. Do they need shelter? Yeah, they need shelter. 
that's shade. I'm gonna put one there. I don't know if he could walk on that though. But so we got some sh grass over here. I don't know if he could reach that. <laughs> Maybe we'll see. Um, what's these are good for basking. So we'll put put another one over on this. Oh, I don't have freaking money. Okay, so hopefully that's enough. Hopefully that's enough to attract another frog. I hope. Crossing my fingers. It's looking so cute. Thank you. I really want to be able to buy some of these things, but I don't have enough. Oh, I do. I could buy one single curb. <laughs> um, direction and traversal. Ceramic plant that pot that you can place almost anywhere. Even better is the included soil for planting in. Make your garden cozier by adding these in good spots, but be careful to not burn yourself. What is that? Oh, it's a torch. And then you've got lanterns, curbs. I can make a pole for some reason. A stool. You know what? We're going to make a stool. Can't afford to buy it, but I could put a stool like over here. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, 25,000 cannot. I just want this tree though. That's all I want is that tree. I love you. I love you and I love you and I love you. Where's the other one? Do I only have one? Oh, he's over here. I love you and I love you. <laughs> so maybe because I think this stuff doesn't cost me anything so we'll just do that I'll put my stone back once it grows Boop. there we go and then any nectar, nectars, nectars, nope, okay. And we will fast forward the night oh, as a nectar falls. <laughs> We're probably only going to play for a f like just a little bit longer. I want to get to, the, was it 28 or 29 days or whatever? Um... But yeah. So that's where he lives. Oh god, is he coming tonight? Dang it, he's coming again tonight. <laughs> oh, I am not doing a no-cam stream. What is it talking about? I forgot to do this. Is it cam on? I think... <laughs> Because I'm stupid. Forgot to turn off that timer. I have it turn on um, channel point rewards. So there should be... Yep. My stretchy, stretchy, my pet, the streamer are now activated. <laughs> um, there we go. There we go. No more decay. Oh, can I afford a grass? Because this needs to have a grass. There we go. A uh, stool. Where am I going to put the stool? I'm going to put the stool over by this water. Right there. Ha! Look at that. That's cute. The cam is on bot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I made a command that if I'm doing a no cam stream, it turns on the timer and it, like, turns off a few... Um, of my channel point rewards and I forgot to, to turn it back on when I'm not doing no cam streams. <laughs> so yeah. He bites it. You eat it. So can I please have another frog? That would be awesome. <sighs> yeah. 
do 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 do. Gotta do it three times. There's one. Is that the only one? Was he the only one? <gasps> he was the only one! <laughs> dork. I am a dork. I'm sorry. Sorry about it. Is that... Is it 29 days? So I have to complete today to get that one. Is there not any... Nope. None. Oh, there's one. There it is. One tiny neck doors. Two tiny neck doors. <laughs> GG's. Thank you. At least there was only one. Okay. Um, Please give me a frog soon. I want a froggy. Grass. Oh, he needs like reeds, right? We need some more reeds. Not re Yeah, reeds. There. Here we go. Oh. Hello, Cabal. Welcome in. Playing with the game called... Oh, my God. <laughs> I cannot spell today. Horticular. <clears throat> I really need to add that to my stream deck, but my stream deck doesn't want to work apparently right now. So for some things, at least. Look at, they're walking all over the water. How cute. <laughs> do, do, do. I'm finally catching a stream. Well, welcome in. I'm glad you're finally catching a stream. I got a, um, oh shoot. I got a Steam code from the developers of this game to play the demo before it's released to the public. Um, so that's what we're playing today. Can't believe that I have to fix a rock. <laughs> but welcome in. I'm glad that you're here. Oh, dope. Yeah. So yeah, we're playing this game. It's a demo, but so far we've been able to play a whole bunch of it. So we'll see. May I wonder if it's like a month long thing or something. Like you can only play for the month. Day 29! We finished it! The task at least. Yay! Okay. Where's all my nectar? Nectar, nectar, nectar. No, over here. And then over here, there's a goldfish. Who does needs a home there you go got you a home okay wait let me see can i look habitats goldfish is not considered a is it just showing me where they are that's a frog keeper 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 can i not Is this not considered frog land? <laughs> okay, so we have a basking. We have, what is grass? Grass is foliage. Do we just not have enough, maybe? Okay. That time it was me. <laughs> I think my um I think my internet crashed on me for a bit, but we're back. We're here. I need to fix things. Pick up my nectar. Fix this. 
Alrighty. And we'll fast forward. It's back. Yeah, I know. I was sitting here waiting. I was like, turn green, turn green, turn green. <laughs> Day 30. Are you coming tonight? He's coming tonight. Okay. Well, still need another frog. Still need another frog. Oh, koi details. I don't want to get koi yet, though. A lady fern. Oh, wait, do you have a male fern? <laughs> Sand, land, the result after millennia of worn down rock and minerals, both a natural home to animals and a glacially paced renewable resource for manufacturing glass. Okay, well. I just need another frog. That's all I need. Just give me another frog, please. Turn green. It is green. We're going to go to day 30, and then I'll probably um, finish out day 30, and then we'll probably head out and um, head out and uh, raid over to somebody. So we got basking. We got shelter and foliage and water and land and shading, right? Is this shading? Yeah, shading. Plantain lily, maybe? For shading? Ugh. Ugh. Twenty eight weeks earthquake. What do I do about earthquakes? That's new. There's going to be an earthquake. <laughs> Officially in the stream. I'm going to in a minute. There's going to be an earthquake. I don't know what's happening. Earthquake. Ah. Hey, Cannoli, that is an earthquake. They are infrequent, but once in a blue moon, they occur, damaging all of your items. There is no simple way to predict when one will happen, so we just have to cross our fingers. Anyways, we just thought you would want to know. Okay. That's it. That's not that bad. It's not that bad, okay? It's just get a few things in at a time. Like if it's close to something else, you can. Do, do, do. There's all this. There we go. That's all you ruined? Nice. Well, let me pick up my nectar then. I think that's it. Nope, there's one. Oh no! You're corrupted! Okay, we gotta get him uncorrupted. No? Okay, well. He turned into a nectar, but whatever. Nectars. Connector. <laughs> okay, well, that's the end of day 30. We got 30, day 31. Is that it? Can I click on this? Rainy, rainy day. It's a very rainy day. I gotta love on my guys. Ugh. <sighs> My little froggy. Oh, shoot. My little froggy. OK. 
Okay, well, I need another frog. Can someone give me another frog, please? Um, I can afford stuff now. Shelter. Oh, okay. Well. Shoot. I wanted the log. <laughs> right there. Will that attract a frog? Because I don't know what else is going to attract a frog. I just want another frog. <laughs> Complete 28 weeks. Why did I click on that one? Can't dig any of that up. Guess that's her. <laughs> Can you just give me another frog, please? That's all I want. Just one more frog. One more frog. One more frog. <laughs> It's literally all right here. It's literally all right here. I don't know. Adaptation? I don't know what that means. Item variation? Cool. There's definitely different items. Whatever. Whatever. Are you going to fix that for me? One more frog! I don't know if it's going to happen. So we'll just fast forward. <gasps> so much stuff. Okay. 32. <laughs> Alrighty. I think... Let's just end it here because obviously... This frog doesn't want to come. So we're just gonna, f yep, quit, leave. Yes, okay. Whew. Alrighty, let's see, does this work? That works. Alrighty, let's see who's online. Let's see what is haps, happenings on the Twitch. See who we can send you over to. I want to see. Maybe. There we go. So like I want to see if maybe. Someone else is playing this game. Let's see if someone else is playing this game. Forticula. Just me. <laughs> I'm the only one. Okay. Well. Let's see who's online. Let's see who's online. Hmm. I'm just going to go all the way to the bottom first. And then scroll up. Okay. Let's see. Sam the Unicorn. I haven't seen her in a while. Grantis is on. Phil Modder. Okay. We're going to actually go see my friend Film Otter. I met him at TwitchCon. And uh, he was so nice. Him and his boyfriend. So we're going to go over there. So this is an 18 plus stream. They are playing Don't Starve Together. Um, I don't know if he's playing with somebody or not. But we're going to go right over to Film Otter. Oh, that is not part of that. <laughs> so we're going to go say hi to Film Otter. And... Hold on. Do that. Um, it'll be all the same login information if it kicks you in. Okay. Um, Just making sure that he wasn't yeah. leaving. Uh -huh. Um... But yeah, so let's go say hi to Film Otter. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and trying out this new game. I will be back on Saturday, I believe, is my next stream. Um, I did not make a schedule. I do apologize. But I will post when I'm going to go live on Saturday. 
and we will um, most likely be jumping in back into Fallout. Or I'm thinking maybe if we're playing, if um, I do have The Last of Us, maybe we'll start that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But I love you all so much. If you're not already following me on my socials, I will post my schedule there and everything. So I'll see you guys over at Film Otters. Have a wonderful rest of your night and the rest of your week. And I'll see you guys on Saturday. Don't forget to copy that raid message. Don't forget to copy the raid message. And I will see you guys over there. Bye, guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, me and a few friends of mine tonight are playing Don't Starve Together. It's me, Puzzles Monkey, Pre Preppy, Pro Retro, and uh, Nightmare God currently. So welcome in. We are having a lot of fun with Don't Starve Together. We are just now rebooting the world um, because we all just died. Uh, <laughs> um, but, you know, we're having a good time. Ubu, how are you?